So guys, welcome back to more Final Fantasy VII Remake. Uh, first off, thank you guys for all the support on this series so far. I've been kind of cranking these out each day. Uh, so if you guys want more of this game, quickly just keep it up. All the support's been greatly appreciated. Still kind of getting used to uh, <laughs> being a dad and stuff. It's it's crazy, man. I still haven't taken off my hospital bands. <laughs> I'm just gonna... I, I don't know when I'll take them off. Maybe I won't. I don't know. Anyways, you guys are awesome. Best audience ever. Let's get this. Alright guys, here we go. Uh, last video, we just got our first summon. I just wanted to see it really quick. I don't really know how it's going to work in this game. So this is the fire one. Uh, attack is Hellfire, which that's exactly what it was. It's like a rush past them. Yeah, that's so cool. I can imagine it's going to be kind of nuts as we get different ones. I don't know how they're all going to be, but uh, yeah, I'm excited. Alright, let's get this. Did a lot of side quests the last two parts. Thank you guys for sticking with me on this. You all set? Uh, yes. Awesome. Meet me at the station after dark. Don't be late. <sighs> it's just another job. Tough break. They changed the times. Last train's already left. Which is why we borrowed these bikes. Need a lift to the plate? How did you guess? Easy. You've been acting weird. Like talking about one thing when you're obviously thinking about something else. Yeah, and don't get me started on all that pep. All right, I'll give you that. But how did you know I wanted to head topside? Was I talking in my sleep? What else did I say? No, we just figured you wanted to see your parents, that's all. Nailed it, huh? Yep, right on the head. So, seeing as we don't have any family of our own, how about you let us be a part of yours for a bit? You know, spread the wealth. Hmm. Are your parents still around? Huh? Uh, no. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay then, guess you're all invited. Here's to awkward family reunions. Yeah! yeah! I take it you boys have your brand spanking new IDs? Yes, ma'am. Then let's lay down some rubber. Ah, Try that rubber. Okay, you got it. You hear me? Yeah. Just so you know, I'm not going plate side for the reason they think I am. Look, you saw the way the reactor went up. It was huge, right? Because of all the Mako. Isn't that what you said? Yeah. That was wishful thinking. Deep down, I know it was my fault. I used a more powerful blasting agent than the directions called for. It had nothing to do with the Mako. Let's say you're right. So what? I'm planning on using a weaker blasting agent this time. But, since I can't get in touch with my supplier, our only option is to loot a warehouse owned by Shinra. Shinra? Good luck with that. With your help, we won't need luck. ID scan! Ready? Alright, here we go. Yo, look at the controls going on. They'll come for us. Yeah, what he said. Oh man. Just this is like gonna be that? nuts. No need to worry. We've got cloud, remember? Hey, you do know how to drive, right? Soldiers get mandatory training. Well then, you gonna take my breath away? Make my head spin with your amazing skills? Don't blame me if you get sick. <laughs> Ready to fight some people, man. We've got company. Probably like the game fun. Road Rash. I don't know if you guys ever played that. Long time ago it came out. Here, take that. Man, I, I remember this part of the game. It was just like 
this it's I'm so glad this this doesn't take away from the original game at all. I like that the fact that they oh, let me block up a little bit. Some guard going. I want to try this spinning slash. Oh wow, that got that doesn't have. <laughs> All right, well now we know the range on that. Of course not. The cold-eyed mercenary's heart suddenly began to melt. Nope. I won't forget that. <laughs> Wait, is it just me or did we slow down? Just you. It doesn't take away from the original game. I feel like that's also still gonna hold Whoa. up. Over time. Gotta be do? careful. Hold on. All right, I'm gonna try to spin slash from the last person. Oh, hold on. Ooh, watch out. Uh, I'm getting stuck on you. Nice. Let's go, baby. I keep wanting to hit this ramp. I don't know if it's gonna do anything though. If you guard it, XC, oh, they're gonna drop something behind him, I think. Yep. Oh, come on. Hold on. We get closer. All right, let's see if we can just get a little closer. Keep dropping, like, whatever grenades or whatever that is. All right, got, got one. We're good. Now I can just kind of cruise up there. <laughs> I love that. This always reminded me, so I played this game in Metal Gear Solid around the same time, I think, when I was little. Oh, dear. But I remember, like, the end of that game had that little sequence where you're on the, the car trying to escape. Or you're, like, on the truck or whatever with the turret. And so it's just, it's funny, like, this this always reminded me, every time I play this or that, I remind each of, you know, of each game or whatever. I don't know what I was trying to say there. Words! Sometimes it bees like that. Alright, we're good. The soundtrack for this game is really good. I mean, obviously, it's a lot of the same symphonies and stuff they had in the original. Uh, I'm keeping them in the videos. Just hopefully my stuff doesn't get hit. We'll see. Soldier en route. HQ saying he's less than a few minutes out. Copy. Think it's him? Probably. Gotta guess chapter four is just this. We'll see. All right, we got that guy down. I used to play that game Road Rash on the Sega Genesis. And <laughs> you would like kick each other off of uh, bikes and stuff. Pretty cool, actually. Right, here goes nothing. Wait for it. That's the next soldier for you. Next to him, you look like kids on trikes. You're damn right. You're part of that weed, don't you? We made it! Woohoo! Tough side! Keep going till we hit the station? No, head straight for the warehouse. Aww. I haven't seen a checkpoint in a while. I wonder if we're gonna actually have one. Hold on. Yo, that does a lot of damage. What in the world? I don't know if it's because I hit the wall and they got pushed into it or what. Let's go, man. This game is tight. I'm not even lying. Like, it's it's such a good remake. Not even the same game, really. It's just a whole new take on it, which is why I'm kind of glad it's also like that. 
Uh oh. This is gonna be fun. How can one man possess all that power? <laughs> I like that song. Oh, this guy is freaking me out. Hold on. Splendid! I've been looking for a new dance partner. Grab it, party, huh? That's fine. What the? Set up for a race then. Just one. You talking to me? I most certainly am. No. Uh, so terribly sorry. Your words failed to reach my ears. I can't go any faster, like, to catch up. My name is Rose. You may address me by the more accurate appellation. Speed Demon! Heard that, huh? That's gonna push me back. Yes, yes, this is the contest I've been waiting for! One all offense, baby! The hell with guarding! Uh oh, guard! My bike is not going to hold up. I thought this, for some reason, I thought this scene was a little, like, further out. Because I thought Bob went to, like, the church and stuff. Maybe that's coming up. I don't, man, my, my timetable is a little, little shot right now. Let's go, let's go, come on. Going in, I don't care. Same shit. I'm gonna guess that electrical attack is like a lot of damage. Woo. That's pretty good. Okay, nice. One with the machine like this. That's kind of cheap. Come on. I don't think I can block that. Low HP, that's not good. Man, I'm so close. Cloud's HP is... Let's try this. Oh, I can do a sharp gust. Okay. Hold on. What's the guy going on here? I just saw that there's two attacks that I could have been using this whole time. Come on. Um... Sharp gust. I don't know how that's gonna go. I might try it, but it's gonna be it's gonna be cautious. That should do it, right? Had enough? Don't be absurd. As if I could ever grow tired of your company. Naughty, naughty! Until one of our flames is forever extinguished, our heads will never rest! <laughs> Do it for me! <laughs> Room! <laughs> Past the red line! Jesse, take over. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> well, well, well. I do believe this round is yours. <laughs> Maybe next time we can keep it just between the two of us. Maybe. <laughs> Until we meet again, my friend! We did it! Go team! Don't get too excited. Reinforcements are hot on our trail.
You failed the test. What test? Driving. I'm great at driving. <laughs> great at scaring your passengers, more like. Not used to having any. Maybe you should just let me drive. Nope. I'll take one for the team and be your back warmer again. Huh? Oh, would you look at that? It's the end of the ride. Go on foot from here. Don't want to draw too much attention to ourselves. Hey, did these things leave a mark? <laughs> they got you pretty good. Oh, and I'm running on fumes. <laughs> Don't worry. We'll top you up soon enough. Now let's roll. That was a top tier little chapter, I guess. I guess we're still in chapter four, technically, but that was awesome. A lot of fun. The controls were actually really well done, too. I'm actually really excited to see the next few areas in the game since it's all like reimagined, you know? Mind doing the honors? <sighs> an arm on you. Employee housing area. Let's get it. Here we are. The employee housing district. Where they put you when your parents work for Shinra. All their reactors were slowly killing the planet. We were living the good life. Hmm. Homecoming, main scenario. I do want to check out the menu really quick. So, as far as the main scenario, so we're actually looking at... So, chapter three, we did all that stuff. Yeah, there's a lot of little sections for each chapter, so... I don't know how many chapters actually in the game. I hope there's a lot. Here. I hope we make it out of mid if, no if we make it out of Midgar. I wouldn't like if we were able to go to like Cosmo Canyon at least just so something along those lines would be awesome. We'll see though. Figures. Still leaves the lights on every night for the girl who only comes home once every other blue moon. Mom's an old-fashioned type like that. Think she'll make us pizza? Her Midgar special? She's quite the cook. Quick to whip up finger licking food, even if you drop by in the dead of night. And she loves guests who ask for seconds or thirds. Uh, can we go inside or okay. we just. Let's head in. Okay, there we go. Cloud, <laughs> you know what to do. Why don't you wait around the corner over there? The uh, Jesse job, okay. alright. It's a shame you won't get to try the Midgar special. You would have really liked it. With your help, we won't need luck. You'll take on just about any job, right? Well, I need you to rob my house. Think you can do that for me? Huh. Go in through the back door when the coast is clear. The signal will be obvious. Once the lights come on, it's go time. Time to go. This is such a unique take, because it's like, I remember certain elements of this, but... I, I don't, I'm, obviously it's all in the same order, but I'm just, they really emphasize certain spots of the game that weren't huge. 
and other parts they just kind of skimmed over. But that's just the way it is, you know? I, I think so far it's been really well done. Inside, you'll find a room with two doors. Don't take the one in front of you. You want the room on the right. That's where you'll find it. Like, I think back in that last little chapter we were in was, like, around the town. We couldn't have done... Like, you could walk around that area, but it was never to that extent doing those side quests. It was all kind of newish stuff. All right, here we go. We'll be chatting Mom up in the kitchen, so don't even bother being quiet. There's no way she'll ever hear you. Dad'll be in there, but it's okay. I need you to grab his Shinra ID card. And yeah, I know I should do it myself, but... <laughs> but I honestly don't think I'm up to it. Just do this for me, okay? Yeah, let me go. Oh, what's this? Hold on. What's this? Uh, I mean... I guess we could read it, but it's not really ours, is it? Let's do it anyways. <laughs> Eavesdropping. Dear Mom and Dad, Sorry for not getting in touch sooner, but... I'm working at the Gold Saucer as an actress now. It wasn't easy, and I had a lot of help from people along the way. But I managed to land a starring role. And closed our two tickets to my play. Looking forward to seeing you both there. Jesse Raspberry as the princess? I'll take another one, please. Oh, we're kind of just like walking around <laughs> looking at everything. Heads, don't hurt yourself. Just snooping around, you know? Jesse. Eat as much as you like. That's a conference call, Fallen, if I've ever seen one. Good gracious. <laughs> I'm online, too. I've seen those way too many times. This isn't it. I mean, I'm just exploring, really. I know what we're here for, but, like, you know. I bet this picture... Nope. And here we are. Kind of just taking it all in, honestly. Yeah, hold on. This has got to be the spot. My dad. He was a maintenance supervisor at the reactor. Thanks. Alright, we got it. ID card obtained. This is amazing. So we just, like, leave? <laughs> Cool, you can kind of see him talking, like the text and everything. Oh, wait, why is it like? Okay, there we go. Camera had me stuck for a minute. So we just, I guess, get back in our normal spot, or we go around the front, knock on the door, you know, say what's up. No, we're just gonna stand over here and wait. Mission accomplished. When are you going to give up on the gold saucer? How long has it been since you even performed? Uh... A lot of people really rely on Jesse. As a stagehand, though, right? You can be one of those anywhere. So why not come home and get a job at the Sector 8 Theater? Uh, I'll think about it. You know, I'd really love to stay and chat, but we gotta go. So soon? Yeah, well, we hadn't even planned on dropping by. But Wedge wanted some of your famous mm. pizza. So good. Sure I can't tempt you with some more? Maybe just a couple slices, Mrs. R. What? Hey, I'm I'm doing it for you guys. You don't want me going to work on an empty stomach. 
I'm planning on using a weaker blasting agent this time. Since I can't get in touch with my supplier, our only option is to loot a warehouse owned by Shinra. Hey there. This it? Now comes the hard part. I'm gonna use this to sneak into the 7-6 Annex. <sighs> All right, let's get to it. Sorry, but you're staying outside. Only I know what to steal from where, so it's gotta be me who goes in. So, we came all this way just to eat pizza? <laughs> you think I'd let you off that easy? You're gonna earn every slice helping Cloud. Just do the thing where you draw everyone's attention away, like you did at my parents. What's the word again? Maybe I'm more nervous than I thought. Diversion. Yeah, that. Nice one, military man. So what? Does this mean we're gonna ask some Shinra folks out to dinner? Uh, you know damn well what she means. <clears throat> While you're inside, we make sure the guards are focused on the outside, yeah? Exactly. Couldn't have put it any better. When you see a flare go up, that's your cue. Rush the front gates and make for the warehouse plaza. The more hell you raise, the more time you buy me. Huh. You're gonna run this guy into the ground, aren't you? How much time do you think you'll need? Not too much. I'll be in and out. I'll send up another flare when I'm done. We rendezvous in the vacant lot up ahead. Hold on. How are we supposed to get back to the slums? Wait for the first train? No. I want to be back before that. Don't worry. I have something worked out. Now, let's get this done. <laughs> well, that diversion's not gonna create itself. Jesse's dad was in there, right? Yeah. Mako poisoning. <sighs> Happened while Jesse was doing a show with the gold saucer. Ah, what do you care? No, I want to hear it. Jesse always wanted to be an actress. Worked her ass off for years, until finally she caught a break. Top billing. Parents were thrilled. And then, right before opening night, her dad had an accident. Collapsed from overwork. And in the worst possible place, Mako storage. Lay there half a day before someone found him. Been like that ever since. No change whatsoever. And that's what got her into planetology. And led her to seek out Avalanche. How far we've come. Jesse's got a theory about it. Thinks her dad's spirit is stuck now. Between his body and the heart of the planet. So if we don't shut down the reactors soon? He'll get caught up in the flow and poof. <laughs> What's so funny? Just that I understand how you feel. Unlike most of the time. I see. 